I usually get, uh, you don't look like a boxer. I don't know what a boxer is supposed to look like. I don't know, I think that's what makes me somewhat unique. In a sport defined by blood and brawn, Michaela Mayer provides the sweet science an uncommon appearance. Just 21 years old, the San Fernando Valley native is one of amateur boxing's brightest stars and hopefuls for the London Games. Doing great, doing great, come on. But all her talents nearly went to waste. When she was a teenager, Michaela's life spun out of control. It was to the point where, you know, I stopped going to school. I wasn't supposed to graduate on, on time, you know. I was in continuation school. I mean, sometimes, you know, I wouldn't come home for a couple weeks at a time. You can ask my dad. I was worried about it. I spent a lot of nights not sleeping and wondering, you know, where she was and what she was doing. It definitely was uh, a short period of time, thankfully, that she put me through where I was really, really thought she was, oh, she was gone. I lost her. You know, and that's just, was sad. But like so many others before her, the fight game became her savior. I kind of had that epiphany where I was like, I need, I just want to do something, anything. And so I thought, well, I must have picked up a new sport, just boxing. <laughs> and walked into the gym one day, pulled my last hundred dollars out of my checking account and just signed up. It was a real, real relief. You know, I've, I have three daughters and, and they're all fairly athletic, but I think this one has a special gift, and uh, it's just great to see. And just a few short years after taking up the sport, Mira is now on the verge of making the Olympic team, and it's a dream that's never far from her and her father's mind. I think about it a lot when I drive. I think about it. I, I'm always thinking about it. Sometimes I have to stop and pull myself away and think about something else. Everything I do, I'm constantly thinking about the Olympics and winning trials and beating certain girls and you know, winning a medal, it's just constantly in my mind. I just would like to just to get there and stay in Olympic Village would be a great dream, you know. But to actually be up on the medal stand, you know, especially in the center, would just be wow. I'm done.